Guess what? So I was talking with my sister a few hours ago, a few weeks ago. So uh, we're talking about we're trying to like collect, recollect memories and all this good stuff, all this fun stuff. We're remembering memories of when we're in school, our first time in school, and all those good stuff. So I just suddenly remembered what happened to me in my first year in school. I was like, um, why don't you film this and like do it like sort of like a story time kind of thing? I was like, yeah, you know what? You're right. I should do that. I mean, yeah. So, without much babbling, I'm just going to get into the story. So, first thing first, I am a type of person that, like, I like to cover my body a lot. I do not like any part of my body being seen, apart from my face and my neck, you know, as a normal human being. So, yeah. Anytime I just had my bath, I'm just going to, like, cover up my body and I'm just, like, run into the bathroom and uh, run, run out of the bathroom and run into my room, like, vroom, vroom. And whenever my mom saw me, my mom was like, why are you doing this? Like, why? We are all girls. Like, and why are you covering your body? What is exactly your body is exactly my body? And I was like, no, mom, I don't want you to see my body. Like, no, like, no way. You cannot see my body. And my mom was like, you know what? When you get to school, you are going to be in the hostel, and you know they are going to like remove your towel from your body without you even knowing. I was like, no, God forbid, that is not going to happen to me. She was like, oh really? And I was like, yes, mom, no way. I am so going to protect my body, my life. So when I got to hostel my first year in in the university when I got to the hostel I woke up by 4 a.m. to still have my bag actually at first it was because I was kind of pretty shy and I was like I didn't want anyone to see my body no way I cannot afford anyone to see my body that is that is so weird that is so awkward uh, but then we had girls in the hostel that they literally walked everywhere without wearing clothes like they literally walk around the hostel, literally naked. So, yeah, but as for me, I cannot do that because I find that very weird. I'm very out of my comfort zone. So, yes, I did that to any of that. So, I started waking up by 4 a.m. Me and my younger sister started waking up by 4 a.m. to have our bath in the morning because we did not want anyone to see our body. I mean... So, there was this particular girl in our room that she has been watching us. She had been watching us for, like, quite a while. Honestly, I was very grateful for our room that time because we had like the best human beings. We had the best roommates. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thank you. I love you guys so much. I love the memories. I love the fun. I love you guys so much. So yeah, I had this particular, particular, particular girlfriend of mine, and she um, she's like this free, loving person with this awesome vibe that like she just flows with everyone. So she flows with everyone first in the room. Like we're all we, we all vibe a lot. So yeah, she uh had been watching us. She had been watching us. She was like, babe, I have never seen you have your bat. And I'm like, what? No way. How would you not see us have our bat? Like, do you expect us to like walk around not having our bat? That is impossible. Especially for me. I cannot not have my bat. Like that is so weird. So then one of our roommates, she always wakes up very early to have a bath. She but she wakes up around five, six. But we wake up around four. It's that bad. Yes, like it's that it's that bad. She notices us and she's like, No, they have a bath, but they wake up very early to have um their bath. And she's like, What? Why? Why do you wake up that early? I am a very early bird. I like to wake up very early personally. Even at home here, I just like to wake up very early. like it's just a thing that I got used to. Like it's a thing I got used to, so I just wake up very early. So she was like, okay, so you do not want people to see your body, but you, you're you like, you, anytime we are naked, we, you like, you just open your eyes and you look at us. I was like, no, that that is not, that, that, like, really, that's not the issue here, so don't try to make it that way. And she was like, no, 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 no. Are you trying to tell me that? Okay. You you know how to cover your body then we are going to, you're going to see my own body. No way. If you see my body, I'm going to see your body. And I was like, babe, don't do this, please. And I said like I mean you and my in you and your younger sister, I mean you guys so much that I am going to make sure I see your body before the end of that particular year. And we're like, No, you can't do this to us, please don't. I was like, Oh, you think I'm joking? And see, when I'm when I make, when I make up my mind to do something, I make sure I do. It's like, babe, please don't do this. It's so embarrassing. Because of that, I do not have my shower at night. I really don't. I don't. I, I stopped having my shower at night. I stopped taking my bath at night. And um, one of my friends, one of the roommates was like, um, babe, why don't you have your bath at night? And I was like, no, I don't want to. I easily catch cold. I was bringing up excuses. 
But then she said, babe, no, you're a girl, you're supposed to be having about like nine. Besides, we've been in this room for like six months, so you should be used to us by now. And I was like, okay, let me just do this. I am going to be brave. Let me just do this. I can do this. Fight thing. So I started having my bath at night. Then this faithful day came. Like, oh my god. This faithful day came. Like she she stopped talking about it about for like some time. She stopped talking about it because she didn't want to like make us suspicious and like freak us out. So she stopped talking about it. And we're like, okay, maybe she's not really like going to do it anymore. Because there's this thing I do whenever I want to like change. Whenever I want to change, um, I go to the corner of my, like, the corner of my, we use bunk. We use, like, this double bunk. So, I go to the corner of my bunk, and I, like, bath the whole room. <laughs> that is so crazy. Because every time I think about it, I'm like, oh, my God, did I really do this? I, like, turn my back to the whole room just because I want to, like, pull my clothes or remove my clothes. So, I turn my back. She has been watching me. I did not know. So, I turn my back. To the room take my towel i like tie it around my waist then i try to like remove any clothes on that but it was really stressful i tried to remove any clothes on them so where did i stop oh I, so that faithful day came and i was like she was watching us like i said i backed the bunk and i I backed the whole room because I didn't want them to actually see my body. I backed the whole room and I was like, um, let me just do this secretly and just like remove my clothes. I covered myself with my towel. Then she was watching me. Like she was really watching me. I noticed that she was watching me, but then I, I was trying to like outsmart her. So like this thing happened and like, um, I was trying to outsmart her. Then... <laughs> oh my god that's the thing we do we go in groups sometimes i always like to go in groups so that like i won't like feel too self-conscious i don't know if you guys understand what i'm trying to say i don't like feel too self-conscious i wanted to go in group with my friends so i was supposed to go with my other roommates like we we're supposed to be like three or four to go together i did not follow them for one reason or the other i stayed behind i can't remember why though i stayed behind and i was like um uh i was like we were remaining um one two three four five we're remaining four rather we're four in the room we're remaining four in the room she was watching me my sister was also in the room with one of our other roommates we're in the room <laughs> we're gisting and i'm the type of person that when i'm gisting with my friends i tend to like be like when i say connected like i like to like be so focused so i was with them and we're like gisting and we're like talking we're having fun she knew what she was planning on doing so she kept she had to like look for a way to keep me behind oh my god i was i was so so like so self-conscious and so so shy so that faithful day i stayed by my bunk and we're talking so when i was about to leave the room this girl stood up and she is like bigger than me she's bigger like so bigger than me and she's taller than i am like i i i am i'm not that tall but i'm not short either but she's really taller than i am and she has she's very she's thick and she's big like oh my god it was not funny that night at all it was not funny so she actually she just stood up in a very nice manner i was already like you know like you know so all of a sudden she just approached me. She was like, didn't I tell you that I was going to remove your tool one day? I was like, please don't do this this night. Please don't do this. Please. I beg of you. Please don't do this. She was like, I mean you this night. I am going to open this up. I was like, please, no, don't. Don't, please. Stop. Don't. Don't. Then all of a sudden she grabbed me. I used my every strength in me. I used every strength in me. Like, oh my God. <laughs> ah! I used every strength in me. So like hold on to my toe because I didn't want like I have never experienced that before. So it was like kind of new to me. I was freaking out. Like I was at this point I was freaking out. It was both exciting. It was both scary and exciting. Like I was I didn't know what to feel. Like I really didn't know what to feel. Like seriously, I didn't know what to feel. So I told her i was begging her i was like please don't do this please don't remove my my towel i'm so embarrassed please don't do this she grabbed me i was still by my bunk she grabbed me then 
I, 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 she was like trying to struggle with me, trying to remove the toe from my body. And I was like also struggling back because I didn't want to like, I didn't want her to like remove it from my body. So, um, at that moment, I, I almost tripped. Yes, I almost tripped. So I fell backwards towards my bunkie's bed, like my bunk mate. I, I fell backwards towards her bed. I fell backwards towards her bed and I literally fell flat. Like I fell flat, flat on the bed and we gave her more opportunity to like rest on me. She used all her power on me and I was just so embarrassing. Oh my God, like really, you're so embarrassing. Oh my God. So I fell flat. She literally pounced on me. Like she pounced on me and she grabbed my towel. At that point, I, was, I, was, I just couldn't afford to like give up. I couldn't afford to give up. So she grabbed onto my towel and she literally used every strength in her body. She used every strength to remove the towel from my body. I was like, oh my God, this has finally happened. I literally just closed my eyes for some seconds and I was just there flat on the bed. Because I didn't even know what to do. I was so embarrassed. I was so flat. I, that, that was, oh my God, that, that was so embarrassing. Thinking about it, I am so embarrassed right now. Like really, oh my God. So she literally just lay down like she was like is this not it like is, isn't this it like what you what exactly is on your body is on my body I was like god i know but this is not like this is not just this is so embarrassing like this is so bad so like it's not what is on your body that is on my body i am literally seeing it finally you have been hiding this for like ages i was like no it's not like i'm hiding it's just i'm not comfortable opening my opening my body i am not comfortable i'm not that type of person i do not know how to do that kind of thing so she was like this is not it this is like, i was so embarrassed like oh my god she also did, did the same thing for the other girl who wakes up around six but hers was more, more funnier because <laughs> like she behaves like a turkey like she behaves like a turkey so much that was so funny like thinking about it i am so 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 embarrassed so so embarrassed you guys like really embarrassed i hope you guys enjoyed this story of mine it's a very weird one it's a very embarrassing one for me but i just wanted to like share this experience with you guys it was actually kind of fun i was but i don't i can't even explain how i felt that day but like it was really scary um funny and i, I don't even know i was like <laughs> I was for, for the few seconds after she opened my toe, I went blank. Like I went blank. I was so embarrassed. Like so so embarrassed. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little story of mine. If you guys have like any um embarrassing story you'd like to share, please put that in the comment section. I'd love to hear you guys weird circumstances. If you guys have been in any one, any weird circumstances, please put that in the comment section. Also give this video a thumbs up. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Oh please consider subscribing if you're new to my channel. Please consider subscribing and if I'd love to know any if you guys have like any other video ideas you want me to try please put that in the comment section and i'll get right on it i'll see you guys in my next video i love you guys so much bye